this is a this is a pretty nice neighborhood. Very nice neighborhood. It's a uh, very safe. It's not you know pop pop <laughs> pop pop Provo. <laughs> <laughs> moved to America, you know, I went to stay in a rough neighborhood with a Jamaican auntie, but when I called her on the phone to find out how safe it was, she gave very misleading information. I said, I, 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 is it safe, auntie? She goes, oh yes, it's plenty safe. I always see the police. <laughs> and I knocked on the door, this all happened, I knocked on the door and this is all I heard. <laughs> I'm like, auntie, she goes, don't worry, only five more laps to go. <laughs> Ask my cousin for advice, you know, because he grew up in the neighborhood. I was asking for some tips, but he gave the weirdest advice. He goes, it's all good, man, as long as you don't walk around all soft. I was like, no, man, I walk like I normally walk, you know. <laughs> he said, even I want to rob you. <laughs> Guys, I've actually designed a walk that scares gangsters. If you're ever on the mean streets of Provo, <laughs> you can use this walk. If you see four gangsters walking late at night, <laughs> this is what you do. Because <laughs> no one messes with crazy. smile. <laughs> I even tried karate, but that gives you false expectations, you know, because in karate class, it's different from the streets. You've got to greet your opponent before you defend yourself. How's that going to work? Give me your money. Wait a minute. <laughs> Ready. <laughs> My mum was worried about me. Do you know what she bought me? Pepper spray. <laughs> I'd rather take my chances running. Can you just imagine me saying, if someone comes up to me and says, hey, you want a piece of me? No, no, wait a minute. I'm just going to shake it up. <laughs> Stand back. I mean it. I'll squirt. I, 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 sometimes I do these shows in, in colleges, and there was one time I did a, a college show, and it was a predominantly white audience, much like this. <laughs> <laughs> and I said, you can ask me any question uh, about English people, and one woman puts her head up. She goes, excuse me, what do black people in England eat? <laughs> and everyone went, ooh. <laughs> I said, that's a good question. When I'm really hungry, white people. <laughs>